Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. It's Polyester here. This is my second YouTube channel called Poly Pops, where I make videos about my hobby of collecting these Funko Pop figures you see here behind me. And well, our friends down in Australia at Pop Culture had an amazing Black Friday week sale, which was 30% off all in stock Funkos, even things that they just brand new got in. So I put in four different orders and they all arrived today. So I'm just gonna shoot them all as separate individual um, videos here because I wasn't planning on having them all arrive at once because I, I ordered them all a couple of days apart just to space them out, but then they all came here today. So I don't know which one is which. We're gonna go ahead and just start with the first box and open them up and see what we get. Uh, you know, as we normally do, it's gonna be a lot of um, exclusive items that we can't get here in Canada that they're able to distribute in Australia. And just to save me from ordering things from Target, Box, Lunch, places like that in the United States, individually, I can get them all one-stop shopping from pop culture. That's generally why we do this. All right, I, I remember something in here has the opportunity to be a chase. Maybe not in this box, might be in one of the other boxes, but I went a little hog wild with the orders because of the significant discount. I said, well, now it's time to just load up and get everything that we need here. Okay, so let's start with this. This is the most obvious thing here. This is a New York City comic convention. This was late in arriving for some reason. This wasn't available the same time as everything else. This is a nice heavy figure, but now they got it in. So here it is, the 2023 fall. That's the New York City Comic Con convention. This is the Owl Bear from Dungeons and Dragons. This is from the movie, the White Owl Bear here. Uh, yeah, you can see there, Honor Among Thieves. This is part of that series, the Owl Bear character. That is very cool pop. This is one of the ones I was looking forward to the most from the New York City Comic Con. So I was a little bummed that it wasn't available when everything else was, but they got it in eventually and worked out to my benefit because I got 30% off, right? All right, next. No idea. We're just going to grab them one at a time. Aha! Stinky Pete. So this is part of the Toy Story series as voiced by Kelsey Grammer in Toy Story 2, I believe. And uh, this was a specialty exclusive sticker. That's weird that this has that special edition sticker. I thought it would have the specialty store one that they have a new specialty store sticker, but I'm not a sticker collector. At the end of the day, I just want the pops. I don't care what sticker is on it. And they do have this at my local GameStop, but I think they're like 25 bucks for some exclusives now. They're a little out to lunch. So for me to get it for 15 US and then the... Um, 30% off is definitely the way to go. So even some stuff that I can get here in Canada doesn't make sense for me to buy it. Even though I have that edge card that gives me like 10% off, it's not worth it to me. And, and Sinky Pete doesn't even come up on their website. I can't even tell you for sure how much it is, but the exclusives are not cheap at GameStop anymore. Okay, next. This was a Funko Shop exclusive. Now this, see, this is the other thing, like, I'm so happy the 100th anniversary of Warner Brothers is coming to a close. If this logo was up here at the top, I would not like that. I like the, the elf box here. That's fine with this little 100th anniversary. Warner Brothers is fine with the sticker on there, but not the theme of the whole box. So this was Funko Shop exclusive. Again, uh... Oh, I thought I saw a sticker in the back there for a while, for a minute. Uh, again... The agreement with Pop Culture and the Funko Shop is that they're not going to put the Funko Shop stickers on here anymore. They're going to have these international stickers. But I don't care. I just want the pop. And this, that's a neat one. It's Buddy that has made, he's making snowflakes, right? He cut out the snowflakes. Uh, I love Elf. My wife loves Elf. It's one of her favorite Christmas movies of all time. So that's a, a great pop of Buddy the Elf there. I'm remembering now what was in this order. There's uh, an office pop in here, too. Let me see if I can find that one. Here it is. On theme for the holidays. Michael as Jesus. <laughs> he had to turn it up a notch when I think Phyllis was Santa Claus, so he wanted to outdo her. Not to be outdone. Michael Scott is never one to be outdone. So Michael dressed up as Jesus himself. 
on the office. That's a hilarious pop. On the back, they show those uh, fun run pops, the most recent series of the office pops here. Michael is Jesus. This was also a Funko Shop exclusive, and they don't mail to Canada, so it's just a way better deal for me, especially with the 30% off. Mind you, they have had some great sales on, on the Funko Shop if you're someone who was able to take advantage of them. All right, next we got, I believe this is another Funko Shop exclusive, Eddie Van Halen from Van Halen here. Might as well jump. So he's in jumping pose here with the guitar. Yeah, that's a pretty cool one. Eddie Van Halen. I like that a lot. Nice one for part of the Pop Rocks series. Where's his other legs? Is it behind him? Oh, yeah. Behind him. <laughs> Neat one. Okay, next we got... Now, was who was this exclusive to? This exclusive to Funko Shop or the Dog House? This might have been exclusive to the Dog House, that pop-up shop that Snoop Dogg had where they were selling Funkos, which I heard that's closing in the new year, by the way. Not entirely surprising the way things are going with Funko. So this is Snoop Doggy Dog with the hoodie. I think they sold this on the Funko Shop as well. But um, I believe it was supposed to be a doghouse exclusive. Snoop Doggy Dog. Snoop, the Snoop Pops are coming out like crazy. They had a you know no Snoops for a long time, and then they're just firing them out fast and furious. And finally, the last thing in this box. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. We're Marley and Barley. This was also a Funko Shop exclusive, Glow in the Dark. I think it was limited to. 8,000 pieces, something like that. So this is part of the Muppet Christmas Carol. The Marley Brothers were Marley and Barley. Oh! Glow in the dark here. Man, that looks like that's going to be really cool. Wonder if I could get that to go with my lights here. Probably not. Oop. And turn on the black light. Oop. So it looks like their heads are going to glow, perhaps. I don't know. See any glow? Me neither. <laughs> they make a regular version of this and they make a glow in the dark version of this. Uh, I've seen the regular one at GameStop, but I haven't picked it up because this one's really good. I got lucky. I've seen a lot of the... Um, a lot of the mustaches on... I forget which one's which. I think this is Statler and that's Waldorf. Let's go with that and say that that's Wald, Waldorf. A lot of the mustaches, it's a separate piece. And they've been separated. They haven't been glued in properly. So of the two or three that I have seen um, in GameStop, the regular versions, the non-glow-in-the-dark, the mustaches look really bad. So I left them. But I knew I was taking a chance to order this site unseen, but this one came in good. Like a, a lot of... You can't even really see it. But a lot of the mustache pieces are separated on uh, on these. So that looks really good. Very pleased with that. Yeah. And there's the rest of the series of the Muppets Christmas Carol. I think I have them all. I'll have to go through and check. It's hard to remember because there's a flocked one of um, Gonzo as Charles Dickens and Rizzo. I think I'm pretty sure I have them all now. Except for the basic Barley Brothers, which... I don't know. Will I get it? I probably will, but this one is going to be the superior one with the glow in the dark feature. Sure. All right. So that's all we got here for our first box of the Black Friday pop culture stuff. Three more orders to go. So you'll see them in the subsequent days. That's all I have to show you today. As always, thank you so very much for watching. I appreciate the time you spend here with me on my channel. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe as it helps the channel a ton. We'll see you next time. Have a great day, everybody. Bye bye.